If you are looking for the best car amplifiers, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on a personal preference and started it based on the features, prices, quality, durability and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we have included options for every type of customer. So, let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Rockwell DB45. First up in this week, we've used a robustly built Rockus Rockwell amplifier, which provides a very powerful 3200 watts, 800 watts RMS. The DB series is a pretty impressive one overall. The components used are great quality and can hold their own among the most popular amps from top competitors Rockford, Fosgate, and Kicker. This affordable 4-channel amplifier provides a high-output, low-impedance solution for powering your car's bass speakers. It features a great subsonic filter and has a fully adjustable crossover with differential circuitry so users can adjust their bass to their taste. Another important advantage is the built-in delay soft start technology which prevents the system from turning on all the full volume when they were switched off at, preventing driver damage they are also protected by controlled peak circuitry by a professional grade peak limiter. The guaranteed top quality distortion free playback. Moving on to the next and number 2 with Rockford Firstgate R500X1D. Over to one of the most popular car audio specialists for a look at the competition, we have chosen to review an amplifier at the same price level as the first. Now, to be honest with the product from industry professionals with the knowledge and know-how like Rockford Firstgate, this price level really only covers their one-channel model. It is a prime 500 watts mono amplifier. It too has a MOSFET power supply and features advanced overcurrent and undercurrent protection. It also has a cast aluminum heat sink and highly responsive real-time power supply thermal sensors to further prevent overheating. Onboard is an easy access punch EQ control for a full range of adjustability, it has high-level inputs and RCA pass-through outputs. The number 3 position is held by Boss Audio R1100M Riyadh. Another top MOSFET mono block option would be this fab model from Boss Audio's Riyadh series. It is very well made and very low priced a combination which puts it on the best sellers list and with a good reason. It is a class AB amplifier with great quality linear circuitry, which is why it can cope so effectively with high power outputs. It rakes up an impressive 1100 watts at just 2 ohms, giving an RMS of 825 watts. It is high and low level inputs to help achieve optimum performance and a variable low pass filter, putting you in control of what passes through to your car's subwoofer. The woofer levels can be controlled via a wired NV mode. It also features a bass boost function which adds a whooping 18 decibels to the low end with a simple switch. It also benefits from automatic shut-off protection to prevent shorts. It constantly monitors to detect heat issues and electric failures in the connected speakers. Next at number 4, we have Boss Audio AR1500M. For a direct comparison, whilst the other is fresh in your mind, Here's a quick look at a slightly higher powered option from one of Boss's other popular lines, the Armour series. It should probably come as no surprise that Boss is featured on a list. Whilst we are on the subject, we should probably give you a quick heads up that we have included a fair few Boss products in this article. It is a robust but slimline, edgy looking, killer 1500 watt option. It benefits from the same it benefits from the same great class AB linear circuitry to effectively perform with high outputs, free of distortion. It is some bestly based tunes and really puts user in control with its fully variable low pass filter control, working hand in hand with its bass boost switching capabilities and remote sub control. It too features a MOSFET power supply that can instantly switch between full and non conduction and capably dish out 1125 watt peak RMS power. It also provides switchable inputs. Its sensitive controls allow for adjustments direct from the head unit for a customized optimal balance. 
It is also built in short protection, which will automatically shut off it if it detects the risk of overheating or speaker failure. The number 5 position is held by Rockford R300X4 Prime. If you crave more than a mono option, a fantastic 4 channel choice, which is a step up from the Rock file, we opened our reviews, which is the RX300X4 from Rockford's esteemed Prime line. It is priced just slightly higher than the Rockwell, but benefits for Rockford first gates expertise in engineering audio electronics. It features class AB circuit topography and also has the advantage of Rockford incorporated cast aluminum heat sink to keep things running smoothly. It is a very versatile amplifier capable of running an entire system, which can provide either four separate 50 watt channels running at four ohms. Four separate 75 watt channel is 2 ohms, or even two channels bridged working at 150 watts or ohm. An ideal setup would be full range or competent speakers on the front channels with subwoofers on the rear running in bridge mode. The number six position is dominated by Boss Audio PT3000 Phantom. Heading back to the Boss Audio range for a flick through the Phantom amplifies the specs which blow away the entry-level bottles we have looked at. It is a premium quality two-channel class AB amplifier with eye-catching statics. Its top-notch MOSFET power supply superbly delivers 3000 watts max power at 2 ohms with a peak RMS power of 1125 watts. It features a variable crossover network of circuitry which enable users to adjust low end crossovers. Users can also shape their profit base equalization utilizing the innovative base post switch. It also harbors multi layer onboard protection against overloads, overheating, as well as short circuit preventation. This upgrade in classification, circuit rate refinement, and voltage comes at a cost, but its exemplary capabilities speak for itself. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Rockford First Gate R150 X2. Whilst we are in the two channel amplifier region, let us just take a quick nose at the competition from Rockford Boss Gate Prime Series. It retails for around half the price of the Boss Audio above, which is hardly surprising. Given that it is a much lower output option, its two channel versatility and onboard protection make it a top contender the best in its class under the $100 mark. It accepts both high-level and RCA-level inputs. It can provide 50 watts to each channel at 4 ohms or 75 watts at 2 ohms. Alternately, you can bridge the two channels together into one 150 watt channel running at 4 ohms. It features a variable crossover for tailoring your base in the mix to suit your taste. It benefits from one of Rockford Force Gates, advanced cast aluminum heat sinks with the top mount controls and of course this super short protection cutoff technology the number 8 position is held by boss audio r1004 back to another extremely low priced option from boss audio which is a pretty astounding amplifier we honestly don't know how they managed to offer up to a top quality multi-channel amp with pristine class ab circuitry but next to no investment. It has four channels to accommodate for high as well as low level inputs. The channels can be used to provide 400 watts at 2 ohms or 200 watts at 4 ohms. The switchable input sensitivity enables adjustment over the input signal from the head unit, enabling a better balance overall between the power levels and sound quality for ultimately better performance. It still features some of the more important built in functions of the more expensive BOSS models, such as the MOSFET power supply, the automatic shutoff protection to prevent shorting, and distortion free efficient liner circuitry. The only thing it really seems to be missing is a variable low pass filter, but in fairness, this can be controlled somewhat elsewhere in the system. Next at number 9, we have Ignite Audio 2 Channel. Now, whilst we could probably dedicate an entire circle to bass and Rockford card amplifiers, in the interest of trying to remain unbiased, let's have a look at what the market has to offer elsewhere. First up for review is the cheap double channel option. It is a competitively priced class AB amplifier from the team at Ignite. 
you can use it at a two-channel amplifier at a high output of 90 watts at 2 ohms or lower at 60 watts. The other option is to use is add a bridged one-channel amplifier for 180 watts peak RMS power. It is good quality circuitry and has a sensitive heat sensory device to help detect and prevent possible overheating. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by SCAR Audio SK2500 1D. Last on our list is the heavy duty high impact 4 channel option from SCAR Audio. We should probably note it as a D class model, so the circuitry might not be as efficient as some we have pursued previously, but it still offers up great versatility in a compact design. It is actually capable of serving up more than 200 watts to each channel at 2 ohms, which is pretty darn admirable for its price level. Another of its greatest assets, it is enhanced set of crossover controls, subsonic filters and crossover multipliers, as well as dampening controls, which essentially make it one of the most versatile amps we have looked at today. So, for a quicker power rundown, here are the numbers. 200 watts into 4 channels at 2 ohms, 130 watts and to 4 channels at 4 ohms. It is a base boost function from 0 dB to minus 9 dB and remote gate control, which is always a bonus for those who like their bass a little louder. Most importantly, the amplifier features a 4-way onboard protection against thermal, voltage, speaker and circuitry failures. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day, so don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.